Bring her up! Come on, Bubba! Uh -huh. One, two, three! Oh, he let me down. Crank her up! Anyways, oh boy, what a smell. That's not why I'm showing you this. Mrs. C.W. said, will you clean up that shop? So, I spent three, four hours finding the floor. I even worked here in this corner. Trying to get my air hooked up, but I need a Street 90 half inch fitting so I can get this air separator, water separator from here to there. Finish gluing up my fittings so I can get my compressor turned on. I got another compressor that you know about sitting here, and I found some of these wheelie things that I've had, forgot all about. You can put them underneath the legs and wheel it around. So I'm moving things around, I got stuff hanging around, I got parts on the shelf that I haven't put away and organized. Bags of filters and cleaners and ball joints and mirrors and I put the stuff I least use on top and I organize stuff. I gotta be fixing things and getting organized. And I had all kinds of bottles that I need for antifreeze and gas. I had them all just stacked up here on top of cardboard that I used to crawl underneath cars. So I put it up against the wall and then I put up a rack for rakes. And I need a bigger one because I got lots of rakes and ra brooms. I gotta put some stuff up here. Oh, what a mess. Organize all my torches in one spot and all my knickknacks in another and all my Corvair air cleaners in another spot. Got lots of Corvair shrouds. I got all the old containers that were full of gummy goopy and some vinyl hose that was cracking from age, so out that goes. I didn't do a thing over here. Look at this. Bought some wrenches when I was in Indiana two years ago. Half price, buy one, get one free. Never even knew where they were. They were underneath some cardboard. Got a whole bunch of them. Ratcheting wrenches, gear wrench. So I'll get to this corner eventually. But for now, I'm working on this back corner. And there. So I'm glad you saw me start up my snowblower. And sorry that I'm putting videos up that I already put up, but I got them on my camera. And I hate to delete stuff that I don't know if I post it or not, so I post them. People watch them anyway. It's post stuff a second time. It's like a rerun, so I apologize for putting up the reruns. But people watch them anyways. Go figure out why. I guess there's always new people. So it's kind of hard to ask if I've posted stuff before I post it. So I post it, and then people watch it. So I leave it up. Got some tires here to sell. What size are they? 195, 75, 14s. Just like brand new. I sold some yesterday. Some 950, 1050, 15s. Some really tall tires off a lifted Suburban. Guy called me, came over in 15 minutes, gave me the money, and he was gone. I'll clean this place up. Hey, Mr. Muggs. Did you remember to turn your clock ahead one hour? Mm hmm? Good boy. So I got some crap out here. I'll bring the blazer around. What started this was I was looking for the tailgate inside cover. Not much. For my blazer to cover the tailgate mechanism. I don't know where I put it. I thought maybe it was in here. There's a Chevy tailgate, mid-90s. There's a Corvair Ramside tailgate. I'll show you the difference in the width of the vehicles. Ten inches or so wider. So, I've got a dentist appointment today to have my teeth cleaned. Got to take care of your teeth because you only get one set. Not like a beaver that they grow back. Got to wash off my trailer from all the salt and sand. It's a mess.
Uh -huh. Cigarette butt. Gross. Got my V-plow. We'll see what that ends up getting put on. Uh, somebody left their garbage here. Very nice. Alrighty. It's a beautiful spring, almost spring day. The maple sap will be running. Maple syrup time soon. We'll get this barn cleaned up. Well, fix her up. Thanks for looking.